hi welcome back to my youtube tutorials this is abian graphics yes on this particular tutorial i am just going to guide you through to learn how to trace a vector image in photoshop yes as you know coral draw and adobe illustrator is the best uh, software that you can use to do what to trace some kind of different different either different colors images and it will be nice for you but on this i'm just going to show you how to use photoshop to do that you get that yes and with this it can only happens when you have image uh, that is not have too many colors even though if it has too many colors there are ways that you can use to do what to trace that particular image you get that yes so first of all let's import in our image by going to file then we come to open i just want to open some one particular distance that i wish to use to do this and then it will look so beautiful first of all let me pick up this particular distance let me open up this uh, particular image yes as we can see it has two colors that's white inside and this particular uh, green you get that yes so to do that and you can have a nice uh, distance if the quality is not that enough as you can see you can also trace it up to make it to to, to make it look like a, a, a let's say a, a shape a shape form you get that so that you can easily use it and it will have much quality you get that yes so with this what you need to do is to come and look for this particular tool called uh, content aware tracing tool you see content aware tracing tool so those who have photoshop the latest photoshop have this and if your own doesn't show up what you need to do is to go to uh this place you need to go to edit then you come to, you scroll down to preference then you click on trade uh, technology preview then when you click on this particular technology preview a sub menu will appear uh, a sub menu will, will appear for you then you do what you take that particular uh, content away so this one should be enable uh, enable content aware tracing to this one you should enable it and after when you enable it then you said what you click ok then you cannot find it if it is not there you cannot find it over here then if after you do that and it doesn't show then you have to restart your what your photoshop and you will see it you get that so when you have something like this let me close up this yes when you have something like this what you need to do is that you should just look at the 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 the, the, the what is the name the tool when you pick up the tool what you need to do is to start tracing how do you trace it it's very simple you just need to click like this and it will trace it for you it change it give it a color then you click on this it will give you a color you click on this too it will give you a color this one another color this one this one uh you click on this one too is gradual try it's gradual what tracing that particular image for you then you click on this one too then you click on this one that's so nice so with this uh we can get our white back by double clicking on the thumbnail over there then we can change it to any color that we wish if it is white okay but we don't need it that we can have it this color and then on all this you can also change it to different color any color that you wish to use and that will look so beautiful for you you have no problem you can use that and then all this you can change it to any color that you wish to use it for you get that yes so that is how we use a uh, content aware uh, trace tool to trace images let me import in another image over there and then show you another this thing uh, that is uh, okay let me pick up this one yes so on this one too is the same thing that you have to do over there to get your image or to get this particular trace you get that even when it has background let's say let me put on a background on it like this uh let me have a background like this on it so that you can see what i'm really talking about so uh, okay so if you have a background like this over there then you change let me change the color to maybe white all right having white and then let me have it like this okay so even when you have a background if you downloaded an image and it has a background don't worry you can still use it so all what you need to do is select the distance and then come and pick your content aware tool over there then you come and do what you come and trace it up like this then it will give you a color that you wish to use and it's so simple and this one has a much quality than what you downloaded you get that yes so this is why we use a uh, content aware tool to trace 
uh, vector images in Photoshop. Thank you very much for watching. This is Avian Graphics and have a nice day. Bye-bye.